Assalamu alaikum, welcome to Nasir Soft. This is the first video of ODK tutorial series, and in this video, we will talk about the basic of ODK and why we need the ODK, uh, the importance of ODK. So, let's start from here. So, let's understand about the concept of ODK. For example, a manager sent its research officer to the field of crop okay for example this is the wheat crop field in order to interview the different farmers okay for collecting the data for example the first arrow goes to the farmer this one and question about the number of plowing they used the irrigation data how many irrigation uh, they required in during the crops which seed they use and uh, what is the approximately yields per acre okay so whatever the former replied he note down on his own survey question questionnaires okay similarly the second research officer goes to the former this one and interview it and uh, saved all the ins uh, data inside his own questionnaires okay so for example these are the six research officers and then uh, after interview okay so they basically maintain the six individual questionnaires in hard form okay. so basically they entering the manual in data okay so uh, obviously when you enter the manual data some problems will be like the human error so for example they each individual six form now they will enter one by one inside the excel in order to extract the reporting so why not there there should be an android application and instead of the interviewing on the hard form why they not uh, entering on the data on the android application and uh, for example when the internet available and then they just sync on the server so this is the beauty of odk and here odk comes okay so odk that is open data kit and inside the odk first of all we design a form okay i will show you in the xls form okay in this tutorial we will learn about the xls form as well and after uh, designing the form okay for example the each interviewer has its own android application or ios application and inside this they will uh, fill the form and when internet available it is automatically sync on the google drive okay or if internet is not available it is saved inside the own memory okay so when it's seeing inside the google drive then anyone can access that google drive and it will maintain a single sheet for different for each form there will be a new row okay so this is the beauty uh, beauty of the odk so in this tutorials we will learn about how we can set up the odk uh, in the android application as well how we can uh, basically design the form and how you can start with the odk so after watching these all tutorial series, you will able to learn how you can uh, basically uh, create a form in the XML language and how you can basically uh, design the questionnaires, its choices and these all. I will show it to you one by one. And after that, uh, when we design a form, the, the form is like this. Okay, there will be check boxes, a radio button, the uh, dad, the sorting array, uh, the basically the rating okay and we will i will tell you all these okay so we will design the similar form and after designing this form okay uh, you will also learn about how you can set up this uh, and on android your application how you can create your uh, so basically google drive and inside this how you can enter inside the first name and all these okay that we design the form the data and after it uh, all your data is entering okay uh, inside uh, uh, this android application i will also tell you how uh, you can basically sync it on the google drive and how uh, the data is basically saved on the google drive okay so after entering all the data uh, here you can also order this one i will tell you you will also learn about all these after watching this tutorial series okay for example this is a rating and in this uh, you save the data and after that uh, if you want to sync it on the Google Drive, uh, here you can see that I sync it and send it to the Google Drive. And after sending the form to the Google Drive, okay, so uh, the data is populated on the uh, sheet on the Google Drive as well. So at the end, when the data is sent on the Google Sheet, here you can see that all these interviewer uh, data will populate it on the Google Sheet. 
so after watching this uh, tutorial series you will learn all these okay so in the uh, next video so we will start from the scratch of designing the form okay so hope uh, uh, you, this uh, tutorial series will help you a lot if you have any question regarding to this topic you can uh, just go to the video description link uh, and you can ask your question i will answer it to you or you can comment inside the video comment section uh, don't forget to subscribe my channel for more informative videos stay connected to this tutorial series in order to learn the odk have a nice day